Don't be a victim of what some doctors consider a normal TSH. Hi, I'm Dr. Crockett with Zeal Integrated Health, and today we're gonna to talk about thyroid stimulating hormone, uh, often referred to as TSH. And when your TSH level starts to elevate, that's an indicator that the pituitary is really sensing that your thyroid is underactive. And many labs uh, today mislead physicians by using outdated ranges for TSH. And it's really preventing them from uh, providing the most effective treatment to their, to their patients. And what we know, the National Academy for Clinical Biochemistry actually recommends that this TSH range should be between 0.5 and 2.0. And you know, there's several studies that show when your TSH level starts to go over uh, two, two and a half, it's really associated with metabolic syndrome, uh, elevated triglycerides, elevated blood pressure, increased insulin resistance, and even a higher body mass index. And we know all of these things, they lead to diabetes. So it's important that your thyroid is being managed properly and you're using the proper ranges to identify if you have any thyroid uh, disruption. So in the event that your TSH is 2.0, or above, and I would say above 2.0 really, it's my opinion that you really need to be working with a health, health professional that's knowledgeable about the treatment of thyroid disorders. And most physicians that you'll run into, when they see these ranges between 2.0 and 4.5, they'll, they'll often report back to you, hey, you've got a normal TSH level, your thyroid's good, and you're left to continue struggling. And that's why I recommend that you get other tests ran on the thyroid. I recommend that you run a total T4, T3, uh, a free T4 and T3. And then I would run what's called anti-thyroid peroxidase antibodies and thyroglobulin antibodies. Uh, it's often that we find these issues that tell us that there's something deeper going on. We have several patients who have been told, hey, your thyroid's fine, your TSH is normal. And once we run these other panels, we discover they've got something called Hashimoto's disease. This is an autoimmune disease of the thyroid. And it's important that somebody's looking for these things and testing them, otherwise you go misdiagnosed or undiagnosed for years questioning what's going on. So I'm here to encourage you to fight for your right for optimal health. Listen, there's a healthy person inside each of you. Sometimes we got to run the right test. Have a great day.